My name is Robbie. This is my craft corner. And the last couple weeks, there's been this exclusive club that was started in the craft corner. I tried getting in, but they banned life hacks and crafts. Oh, hey, how's it going? Turn around. What? Turn around. I got nothing on me, man. There's nothing on. What? That's nothing. I swear that's nothing. What's this? Nothing. What else you got? It's definitely not craft related. What? That's just my blowtorch, man. What's this? Get that out. It's a sewing kit. I'm sorry. Please let me in. I swear I'm not holding anything else. Bruh. That's just my average hot glue gun. Please let me in. Man. No. I need my crafts. You don't need no crafts. I need my crafts. No crafts. I begged with him. I pleaded with him. Please let me into this club. I swear I won't bring any more crafts into the club. I got so desperate that I tried to break my way in. Hello there. So this is a surefire way to get past the bouncer. According to 123GO that is. Fun ways to sneak anything Anywhere. Let's check out the first one. So what you're gonna do is just throw your friend on your shoulders and pretend like you're an extra, extra tall person. Oh wow, an extra tall person? I feel like I would've remembered you. And the bouncer will never suspect it. I mean, if one, two, three, go says it'll work, it has to mean something. I can't wait to try this one. Look, I'm really sorry that I got you kicked out, but I have a plan to get us back in. All right, what is it? It's really simple. So the first thing I'm gonna need you to do is to put on this big jacket. Okay. I don't have a trench coat, so I think this is just gonna have to do. Okay, how's that? This is huge, it doesn't even fit me. Perfect! Okay, now I need you to hop on my shoulders. Stand on there and then I'll go right underneath. Oh, what? Be real careful. You're it's ready? wobbly. See, we're extra tall. Now I'm just gonna need you to wrap this around me so that you can't really see. Like this. Yes, this looks great. Oh, no one's gonna know you're here. They're just gonna think we're an extra tall person. Yeah, who wears a skirt? Hello, sir, can you please let us in? Let's try this one, guys. Hello, good sir. It is I. I would like to enter the club. I do not have any crafts, as you can see. I am just tall man. You can come in. Uh, 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 uh. You're gonna go. What? Why can't I go in? Come on, buddy. I can go? Come on. Come on. I can go? It's okay. Yeah! What Bruh. the heck? Bye, Robbie. Thank you. It's because I'm short, isn't it? Oh, I gotta think of another plan. So for this one, you're gonna want some starburst. Then you're gonna want to squish the starburst and cut it into fourths. Then you take the fourths and line them up. Get a little skewer and just press it into all the little starbursts. Roll those bad boys up. Make a little sushi. Cut that bad boy in half. Spread the little petals. And then you stick it on a pencil. And boom, you got yourself a little flower. This isn't candy, it's a flower. And no one will ever suspect it. Okay guys, so here are starbursts. Do I do all of them? I think I only need to do a few actually. And I'm gonna go with red. So I'm just gonna pick out all these red ones. Perfect, one down. I think like five should do it. Five might even be too much. Now that we got our five starbursts, I'm actually gonna use some parchment paper and I'm just gonna put them in there and hammer it down. <gasps> oh no, I've broken it. Maybe the hammer is not the move. So apparently I just have to squish it. It didn't really say how to squish it. Do I just squish it with the hammer? Use the force, Luke. I wish I had a rolling pin. That would make a lot of this so much easier. Okay, I think this is probably gonna have to be good enough. Now I'm gonna go ahead and do that with two more of these bad boys. Guys, they kind of look like little pieces of ham. Anyway, we break out our X-Acto knives. A knife! And we go and cut them into fourths real carefully. And then we line them all up just like this. Grab our skewer and just flatten this bad boy out right in the center. Pull this guy out. Then we just start rolling it up real carefully. Just gonna make a little charcuterie board. This is gonna look great. Now we cut this little guy in half. 
grab ourselves a pencil and just start opening this up a little bit and you shove it right up in the middle. We now have ourselves a perfect little rose. Look at that, how adorable is that? Don't try and eat it whole because you will eat this pencil lead, but guys, I'm gonna have to say that this one so far absolutely works. Now let's go try it out, shall we? Oh, hey there! My girlfriend's in the club, you see, and I got her these flowers for her. Can you please let me in, pretty these please? don't even look real. What do you mean? They're that's real can, flowers! That's, that's literally just, that's candy. That's not candy! If it was candy, would I do this? <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, it's so gross! Shit, spit it out, it's definitely not candy. <laughs> that's candy, that's definitely candy. That's 100% candy. Well guys, that one's not working, so maybe I'll try something a little more realistic. So for this one, we're gonna need a little pot and some floral foam. Poke a little hole in the center, then I guess we put some makeup, then we're gonna take our hot glue gun and just glue a beauty blender onto the back of a leaf. Shove that plant right back in there, and boom, now you have makeup that can sneak absolutely anywhere, and no one will ever know. Okay guys, to start off with, I had this pre-potted plant. I couldn't find any floral foam, unfortunately, but... It came with it inside of it with these flowers and it says blessed on it and I am actually truly blessed to not have to do any of the work. So I guess we're just gonna rip all these out. We don't need those flowers. And then we just shove this back in there. Okay, so now we need something to put inside of here to hold our makeup. So I got this paper plate. They didn't really tell us what you were supposed to use. I'm just gonna put this over it. Use a Sharpie to maybe trace it to make it that big. Just gotta make it slightly smaller than that. Use our good old scissors. I might have made it a little too small, but does it fit? Oh, it fits. So we got to poke a little hole for our flower stem. Looks pretty good. Go ahead and shove that right in there. Then we basically make a duplicate one. But we're going to go ahead and grab our foundation and just start shaking it in there. Put our top back on. Now instead of using these little guys I came with it, we're going to use these. Bigger is always better with the craft. That is so much better. I love it. We grab ourselves a beauty blender. I think it was supposed to be green, but you know, I'm sure it's fine. This will blend into the leaves just fine. Cut it into a thin slit. Oh, that is absolutely perfect. Okay, so now that we have this guy, we're gonna take this thing and just glue it onto the back of one of the leaves. Go ahead and grab our hot glue gun and just be real careful to just glue it right on there. I'm not gonna burn myself. I'm not gonna burn myself. I'm not gonna burn myself. Ah! I guess it is a Robbie video. So that is on there. And now it's nothing but an inconspicuous plant. I'm gonna bring this to the club. I'm gonna say that I'm bringing this for my girlfriend's birthday, but we all know that that's a complete lie. Okay, now it's time to see if this will actually work. Hey, Mr. Security Guard Man, I'm back with real flowers for my real girlfriend. Can I please go into this very real club? All right, I'll let you in now. Oh, thank you so much. You won't regret this. You won't. You won't regret this. <laughs> Well, guys, I guess I'm gonna have to say that this one works. Check it out, guys. I got makeup. I snuck makeup into the club. Did someone say makeup? We just put the makeup all over her face. What? No. No makeup allowed. So this girl has an idea. She's gonna pretend that she has a little toothache. She's gonna get some sugar glue, and then she's gonna start gluing all of her M&Ms to the fabric. Look at her. Oh, she has such a bad toothache. Or does she? <laughs> Okay guys, so for this one, we're gonna need some jelly beans. And unfortunately, in the United States, we don't really have anything called sugar glue. I don't even know where the heck you'd buy that. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put them in the face bandage, spread them all in there, maybe wrap it around once. These jelly beans are perfectly encapsulated. Now, I'm just gonna go ahead and wrap it underneath my face. Look at that. Oh, my wisdom tooth. Oh, it hurts so bad. Now let's see if this one works. Oh, oh. hey Mr. Bouncer Man, can I please be let in? I have I have a really bad toothache, and I think that clubbing's the only way to make it feel better. Who comes to a club with a toothache? Me! All That's right. me! Whatever, whatever. Thank you so much. I know I say this a lot, but you won't regret this. <laughs> Your boy has done it again! Look at this, guys. I got some jelly beans. I hid them in my little toothache thing. Oh yeah, you want some? You get jelly beans. You want some jelly beans? Here, I'll feed you in here. Oh yeah, you yeah, get jelly beans. Yeah, some good jelly beans. Woo! Yeah! Oh, they're joking! Oh my god, does anyone know the Heimlich Maneuver? Oh my god! What have you done? Ah! 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 So you're at the dentist 
and you're trying to sneak your candy and soda pop in, but you're just not allowed. So you're like, oh no, what am I supposed to do? You get a little idea from the fish bowl. You're gonna pretend that this little gummy shark is your pet fish. Then you're gonna put it in a bunch of Sprite in a bag. And now you're free to have soda while you're at the dentist. Oh, that's a dream. But will it help me get candy past the bouncer? Okay guys, first thing we're gonna need is a Ziploc bag. Then we grab ourselves a Sprite. I think they might have just used water in the video, but I'm gonna use Sprite just to be extra safe. Make it extra sweet, you know? That's some very, very fizzy water. Then we're gonna grab ourselves some Swedish fish. I couldn't find any baby sharks, so I guess Swedish fish will have to do. Those baby sharks are loving, oh look at that. They're all swimming in their little salt water tank. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, let's go test this one out. Hey. It's me again. This is my emotional support goldfish. Can I please bring him in with me? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Thank you so much, sir. Looks like we're having candy sushi tonight! Woo! Just grab a big old grip of him. Here you go, you want that? Yeah! Right. Yeah! This is the best sushi I've ever had! Mmm! Bring your friends up, food! What? Uh, we aren't eating fish? Oh, what are you all doing? No! No, 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 get out of here! No, 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 no! Okay guys, you know what time it is? It's time for everyone's favorite part of the video where we record the thumbnail! So for this one, we're gonna need a pop it. And a pair of scissors. So I'm gonna attempt to cut out the tongue shape. Is this way too big to be my tongue? Uh, I think it is. I think it looks way too big. How about that? I think that's a lot better. Oh my gosh. I haven't really done this yet in this craft corner. Okay, here you go. Oh craft mystery, oh craft mystery, oh how the glue 